Hello and welcome to the Dave Bernan Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Greg Royce with here with Stevenson Cross Country Head Coach Dave Bernan. Coach, you guys uh, Saturday went up to the MAC Conference Championship up at Delaware Valley and um, you had a lot of best, uh, best ever finish for the men, second place. And you know, on the women's side, Kelly Winklebaugh had her best ever you know, place for a woman in fifth. So, um, you know, first let's just talk about the men. Obviously, six all-conference people, two in the top five. Patrick yeah. Watson second and Langston Gash finishing fifth. Take us through that race. Yeah, so, uh, I mean, the guys going in, they really – thought I mean we, we had an outside shot of winning yeah. but um nobody really picked us to win so they kind of went in this went in as the underdog but um I mean to be to finish within 10 points of Messiah I think yeah. is a really big accomplishment and we had some people really step up I mean yeah. for one Pat getting second place nobody saw that coming yeah. um I mean I did but yeah. <laughs> as far as people in the conference and things like that nobody really expected that and then our our fifth guy Nikita Kulik he really came on strong yeah. it was the first time that he was even in our top seven this year and then he was our fifth guy yeah yeah, I know Pat Watson's a guy we've kind of talked about all year. He's kind of being, you know, he's been kind of the second place guy, but you've always said he has that potential to be, you know, right there with Langston. Yeah, definitely. And and Langston kind of had a little bit of an off day as well. Yeah. But if we can get the two of them to be closer together at regionals, it's, and yeah. then, I mean, it's really going to help us. Yeah. And then, um, like you said, a 10 point difference, that's not, you know, that's really not that big. Uh, you know, a couple of guys fish one or two spots higher, push them, you know, a spot or two lower. And all of a sudden you're talking about, you know, you're right there. Yeah, exactly. And, I mean, we're, we're happy. I'm happy with second place. Like yeah. you said, um, it's the best we've ever finished. Last yeah. year we were fifth. Um, I don't remember what we were the year before that, but um, we're definitely improving every year. Absolutely. And on the women's side, um, you know, Kelly Winklebauer missed this race last year because she was hurt. Um, came back, finished fifth, best ever finished for, for female in the program history. Yeah, she ran a great race. She she went out really um, conservative and was actually pretty far back early on, and then worked her way up into fifth place by halfway, and then just kind of kind of hung on there. Yeah, and then um, you know you finished seventh place as a team. You know Achol, she stepped up. She finished seventeenth, mm -hmm. I believe, yeah. um, to get all conference. So it's the first time. I believe you've had two all conference on the women's side. Yeah, definitely. And then, I mean, seventh place. The other thing, if you look at the women's team scores, I mean, fifth place was less than twenty points up. So, yeah. um, I mean, it, we, we were close. I right. mean, and next year, they, I know they're excited about improving upon that. Yeah, it seems like with the women, like you said, you've got a lot of you know underclassmen that are strong and <clears throat> you know have been improving the whole year. Yeah, definitely. We've set, we've had some pretty big jumps. I mean, Emily Gates has been up there all year, but then I mean, we also have. Um, Chloe O'Hara, another freshman, yeah. and then, um, I mean, Carly Bartholomew is another one, and they just keep improving every week, so it's exciting to watch. Yeah. All right, now you've got, you know, a, a couple of weeks until the regionals. Um, what do you do pre to prepare for that? We'll talk a little bit more about regionals next week. Yeah. But, um, you know, what do you do prepare with these two weeks until the regional? Uh, I mean, we're, we're back to work. I mean, this this week, because we have, a, we have two weeks, this week in between ends up being not not a really hard week, but another another kind of – higher intensity yeah. week so that they can get ready to race well in two weeks and um the great thing about the guys is as soon as they finished they were already thinking about what they can do in two weeks at regionals yeah well that's good to hear yeah well congratulations on everything from this past weekend and we'll talk to you next week about uh you know about that ncaa regional okay all right for dave Verdan, i'm greg royce this has been the dave Verdan show